Good morning, everyone. We're live at the market, and it is Saturday, January 20th. Uh, we're going to talk to uh, Vandana and Sam at the Shree Curry Place, who are now in the market kitchen. Um, so they've expanded their menu because now they're in the kitchen. So we're just going to come over to uh, Vandana, and we're going to find out what's new with them. They have some breakfast menu items. And rather than me try and type it all out, um, it's much better to hear it from them personally so you can find out what they have new and the fact that they do have breakfast available as well now. So let's go talk to Van Dan and see what's new over in the kitchen. So we have a scrambled eggs today. So this is masala scrambled eggs. Now it has onions, tomatoes, it has the curry. It also has, um, uh, we have a little spice in it as well. And uh, we are serving it along with tomato ketchup and uh, bread. And of course we can change up the, the bread with rice if you like. And there are options to have it with an and bread instead. So we're pretty flexible that way. It's what you like. We generally ourselves eat it with bread, but I, I prefer it with naan bread as well. And if you love the rice, you can we'll be more than happy to have scrambled eggs and rice. If that's something that you like for your breakfast. Awesome. And is it served all day? It, it will be served till ten thirty. Till ten thirty. Yes. So breakfast will be served. We also have added some snacks which will be served all day. Breakfast will be served only till ten thirty. All right, perfect. So you have some new snacks over here too yes. that you were telling me about. Right. And uh, let's not do the injustice of me trying to explain it. You let everybody know what so you've got. This is like a garlic roti. Uh, it's uh, like a, a whole wheat roti which has all Indian spices and garlic in it. And uh, we make it like a biscuit so it can stay, it's dry and it'll stay good in, uh, for a few days outside as well. So you really don't have to put it in the fridge. But, and it, we also have just a masala roti without a garlic, so it has curry spices. And uh, it's a whole wheat again, and it's made uh, into a biscuit, so it stays uh, dry. Them. And uh, these are what over here we have. Uh, it is like an Indian version of potato uh, um, masala mix. So it has potato, it also has uh, what we call a chana dal. So a chana dal is uh, like a chickpea dal. Okay. Right. Um, yeah, it's not a whole chickpea. It's like a split chickpea dal. Split chickpeas. Dal. Okay. Yeah. And we also have what is called a spicy masala wrap. Okay. Now this masala wrap <laughs> over here is uh, like basically <clears throat> it's a, a we are calling it a wrap. It's basically a roll. It's a, it's a chickpea flour roll. It has um, a lot of uh, spice, but it has a lot of garlic and a lot of coconut in it <laughs> yeah. so this stays outside for a couple of days so, or two as well so you can leave it outside for about five ten days so that's the shelf life and it's a it's a little bit on the spicier side the people who like spice can definitely give it a try and we're sampling right. everything out so if you want to come down to the market and give it a try that'll be awesome right so you can try samples and the potato masala i just gave that a try for anyone who's wanting a comparison it reminds me of barbecue chips <laughs> and everybody should remember too that everything that Shri Curry Place does is vegetarian and they do have vegan option as well. So if you are um, vegetarian or vegan, um, certainly there's lots of options here for you to try. So let's go over to your, you were going to show us your rice puff mix, yes, right? Yes, the rice puff mix is like a flattened rice and it also has some chana dal inside. Again, it has a lot of spice and so this is something we have as snack with tea or coffee. Uh, down home, but I have had people have put it on top of salads, so that's an interesting mix. But we can have these uh, things as we like, so we can put it on top of salad to make the salad a little bit more spicy. So you can put your greens, great. You can so instead of croutons, yes. this is a great option. Yes. Probably, I'm not going to say a little less carbs because I'm not up on that, but it would probably be a better option, certainly more spice, and yes. and also we know where it came from, so that's something awesome. Perfect. And so you still have your, because um, we don't want to panic people, no. you, we still have butter paneer, we right? We still have butter paneer. Yeah. We still have the butter chicken sauce. We yeah. still have the butter vegetable, the spinach, and the chickpeas. And as we go down, we are going to add a little bit more yeah. stuff. So we are going, our plan in them is to add a ca cashew curry. Right. And so that is something going to be really rich and interesting. Awesome. And it's coming up in the... Uh, in, the, in the near future, yes. Near Sam future. just got back from India, actually, yes. what, two days ago? Yes. So he's still jet lagged, but he's here. Yes. So, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> awesome. Right. And is there anything else you'd like to tell anybody? Uh, just come on by. 
be sampling everything and uh, it'll be fun to try out everything and you can decide for yourself what you really like or you want to just try it out. Awesome. And, and uh, it's great to be back in the market in the new year. It feels awesome yeah home and it feels great. I know it's good to be back isn't it so everybody um, that's a good point just to remind you we are now open at the market 9 a.m. till 1 p.m. and we're open until December so you'll find us here and Van Danny here every Saturday uh, for the coming year so we are back open and uh, we're not closing so uh, we're year-round and we will see you we're open till 1 o'clock today so come on down and try some of these fabulous dishes for yourself and of course we've got um, lots of other things going on here too. So come and check it out. We have new vendors every week and we'll see you at the market.